Well, since you're here, I guess we should start another classy corner. So my last video about uh, Laura Piana, you guys really seem to enjoy, and that really thrills me because they are one of those brands where they're known by a select few, but they're often overlooked, and I think they're really awesome. So today, you know, I've talked about the shorts and everything, and if you can see, I'm uh, still rocking those shorts. So when I got back in here to start editing everything, I realized that there were just too many of us outside enjoying all the, the sun and the pool, and I needed to re-record a lot. That's what we're gonna do. All the same words, just a slightly different location, so that you guys have the best possible audio. As I was saying before, I've really fallen in love with the Bay shorts. I mean, these things are fantastic. They dry off so stinking quick. Like five minutes after hopping out of the pool, they're pretty much dry and don't like get my shirt wet or anything once I put that back on, which is incredible. Really what you want in a swimsuit. And I've gotten enough stuff from them now that I can safely say anything you buy from them is really good. Beyond swimsuits, they make great wool. They've just dropped a fall winter line, which to me is insane. I can't think about wool right now because it's still like 95 degrees Fahrenheit here or 35 degrees Celsius. So way too hot to be thinking about wool. But they also make excellent footwear. Since we do have so much hot, sunny summer left here, and probably, you know, wherever you're at to or wherever you're traveling to, I wanted to talk about some footwear that can help you out in the hot summer. Now, I'm a millennial, and I don't have a problem with wearing flip-flops, but a lot of people don't like their grippers out. And if you've ever been on a nice boat, or, you know, someone that has a nice teak deck at their beach house, then you know the number one rule for that teak. And that's no shoes. Because the shoes will scuff up the teak. But like I said, sometimes you just don't want your dogs out. And what are you going to do then? Because you got to respect the rules, right? But you also don't want to show off those little toe digits. That's where the summer walks come in. They're nice suede or calfskin or alligator skin loafers that you can get. But the key factor on them is they're kind of made for walking on teak. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, they have this wonderful uh, white natural sole that is like a gum sole, very grippy, very stable on wet surfaces. But that natural white color means that it's not going to stain anything. It's not going to scuff anything up. It's not hard enough to mess up that beautiful teak decking, whether it be on a boat or an actual deck to a beach home. You don't see very many loafers with the white sole. And I'm not sure why that is, because I like this sole kind of this style bottom way better than like a leather bottom loafer. It's been way more comfortable. It makes you feel a lot more stable when you're walking around. But I've worn these things for the whole summer now and they have been absolutely fantastic. Like when I first got them, they were all nice and floppy like this. There was zero break in period. I mean, these things felt like the most comfortable, well-loved pair of shoes that I've ever had. And they were just like that right out of the box. And you've got tons of beautiful color options. Like this is a nice summery blue. I think they call it a cobalt blue. But all the attention to detail on this is just fabulous. Not only does it feel nice on the outside, feels nice on the inside, it's unlined, but then you have a leather interior there which if you remember my video about the Gucci loafers, that was one of my negatives. I really didn't like that they had the cloth front half and like they insist they do it for sweat. I'm pretty sure they do it for cost cutting measures, but I don't like that even in the summer. It just doesn't feel as good. Whereas these, you know, feel really good when you slide them on and there's that nice soft leather inside. And I think that like already broken in feel that they have, that's what makes them feel so good because when it's summer and it's hot, 
and you know you just want to put on a pair of shoes you do not want to have to break them in because then you're hot and your feet are miserable and that is not a good experience and so the fact that these things come feeling like you've worn them for years is truly awesome because it means you can just slip them on and go and you are comfortable and you have those dogs hidden away from the world, right? Not to mention, you look incredibly stylish to boot. Now, the quality is something I cannot stress enough. I think that quality is what sets Loro Piana so far above most brands. You know, you'll have brands in general or luxury brands especially that do a few things really, really well, but then you'll buy something else from them and it just feels cheap and gross and you're like what's even the point of this like you don't enjoy it because it doesn't feel good on and then you also don't enjoy it because you feel like you got kind of fleeced a little bit because you're like well where did my money go whereas with something like geez anything from Laura Piana you can see and you can feel what that money is buying like there is not a stitch out of place. There is not a detail that hasn't been thought about. Like these are great things and my sneakers are like that. Their baseball caps are like that. Their shirts are like that. I haven't bought any pants from them, but I'm sure they're the same because there, there's been enough from a bunch of different categories that I can safely say, unlike those other brands, like they focus on quality. And again, not only do they focus on quality, they actually pay people a living wage to make these things in Italy for you, which is a great thing. And I am very excited about that. You definitely feel like anything you buy from Loro Piano will be the most well-made version of whatever that product is. And they're not gonna, you know, pull the old switcheroo and just give you something real cheap to make a quick buck. When companies are ever pushing their profits forward, you really have to appreciate a company that focuses on the art and the quality and the aesthetic and the customer experience so much versus trying to just cheap out and make an extra buck or two. But yeah, these summer walks are perfect for by the water or on the boat, wherever, like just summer shoes for when you don't want those little dogs out. And they're absolutely fantastic. But you know, I've talked about them, I've showed them a little bit, and you're probably like, geez, I just wanna see the shoes. So let's just cut to some awesome B-roll so you can see the whole unboxing and get a close-up of the details of the shoes themselves. Let's get to it.
Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that B-roll as much as I enjoyed shooting it and as much as I enjoyed the shoes. Uh, these things have been absolutely amazing. Uh, the comfort is off the charts and the quality and craftsmanship is impeccable. And the fact that they're made by artisans in Italy that are treated fairly is an incredible thing for the company and it makes it well worth your investment in them. But yeah, if you want something that you don't have to worry about messing up a friend's or your own uh, teak decking or flooring, get these things and rock these all summer because they will not let you down. These are super comfortable loafers that just feel like butter on your feet. All right, as always, I hope to see you out there. Bye.